In today's video, we're going to talk about the Microclimber Evo Connected 3 and possibly is this the best reptile thermostat ever? Now, Microclimber actually sent me this thermostat two years ago to do a review and I'm only just doing it now. I just really wanted to wait for a time where I could really use it for something that really shows its capabilities rather than just slap it on a vivarium and be like, oh yeah, it works. So it connects to Wi-Fi and you get an uh, app with it on your phone. And on your phone, you can look at temperatures and control your thermostat from wherever you are as long as you're connected to Wi-Fi. How I'm using it is I have it in my garage on my Diamond Python setup, whereas I'm above the garage in my reptile office working on videos and whatnot, and I can look at the temperatures and change things from my phone without even having to go down and look at Exoterra thermostats or thermometers or anything like that. It even goes as far as when I went to Denmark recently, I had mobile data and I could still even look at the temperatures of my diamond python from a different country away. That's how cool the thermostat is. So it's the morning of the talk. We're in Denmark right now and I can actually look at my phone and look at the app for this thermostat and I can see what temperatures it is in my diamond python's enclosure in a garage in Southampton in the UK from Denmark. So that's how cool it is and how far away you could look at it from. So I think that's cool. And it's a scenario like this that I was really waiting for to stress test and really push it to its limits to really show you, hey, yes, this is really cool. So with the Evo Connected 3, you can have three channels. Now you can set that up for lighting, a ceramic or a basking bulb. You can change it in the settings from dimming to pulse to on off effectively this thermostat does all of them you can actually use it to ramp up the time of day and ramp down and control a day night cycle you can set in different seasons and map out a whole year and allow that to cascade not only up and down every day in daily cycles and daily rhythms but across a year and you can map out the seasonality and let it do its thing that's really, really cool. The other element that I really, really like is if I'm doing this my way, when I have things just plugged into like a, a wall or a extension lead and I put the extension lead on a timer, it takes things from needing an extension lead to everything in your enclosure, plugging into your thermostat and then that one thermostat plug into the wall. That is really, really clutch for cable management. And if you don't have that many plugs in the wall available perfect because this will take three into one so in my diamond python setup i have a radiant heat panel and then i have a uv tube and i have a heat lamp all three of those are connected to this what's really cool about this thermostat as well is it acts as a data logger so you can go into the app and ask it to export it into a spreadsheet for you to look on in microsoft excel or google sheets on your computer so it's not only a thermostat, but it's this all-in-one system. All your lighting goes into this one stat. You can control all of it from there. And it's basically a data logger. Now you can use it in situ in the moment and touch on the screen and control the thermostat and change settings right there on the thermostat screen. Or you can do it entirely from the phone app. It doesn't matter. You can also have as many thermostats connected to the app as you want. So you could have your entire reptile room all connected up to this one app and then you can control it from just sitting in the room and looking at your enclosures. Or if you want to be in Denmark and your enclosure in the UK, it doesn't matter. You can control your entire room from one phone. Now, price wise, they are kind of pricey. There are £188 online, as I can see as the time of recording, to buying just a thermostat. Although saying that, if I wanted to buy like a high range dimming thermostat from Habistat, like I had done previously, that would cost me £70 retail. So from going from just a single dimming thermostat with a dial to this whole blown thing with all the dimming and data logging and seasonality and day night cycles and connected to an app and control it from anywhere in the world going from 70 to 170 it kind of pay it, it, it makes sense the price to be fair if you can afford it if you if you like your bells and whistles and you love your toys and you love technology 
it is cool. I would recommend it. What I will say is I've not really run into any issues yet, but some things that I would like on the app when I'm looking at my data and I want to look at a certain temperature on the graph, I would like to press that point with my finger and it brings up like a, a data point or a circle at that point with a readout what that number is. There's other apps for like different data loggers that do just that. I'm hoping that they could just do like a, um, a software update and just plonk that straight in there for us. Other than that, it seems like near on the perfect thermostat, the best thermostat I've ever owned. And funny enough, I've had it sat in a box for two years and not used it because I wanted to save it for like this big deal of like it going through a concrete wall and it being in the garage and not in the house and really showing you why it's so cool compared to just the one on, on a vivarium. But I've missed out on using it this entire time and it is really, really good. This isn't really a criticism of this thermostat because it's not happened, but in their previous ones, the Evo lights, they have like very, very like, like cheaper versions and we bought them secondhand before and it's very easy to press them when the screen breaks and then you can't actually press things. You have to like jam it with your thumb to actually get buttons to work. Or sometimes people had named the thermostats different things and we can never change their name. So some, a previous person had named their thermostat like C-U-N mm -hmm, and um, we can't change it. So every single time, every day, it resets back to that. So we have that permanently on a vivarium. But maybe they fixed that in this one. Maybe this isn't a problem with this thermostat. So that can't be a direct criticism of this thermostat because it's not happened. So if that doesn't happen for me, then truly this is the best thermostat I've ever used. It's near on 99% perfect to me, apart from I just want that little data point to come up and I click on it and I can look at that exact temperature when on the graph. Now, I don't know if these are in the States or if they're even coming to the States, but even when I went to Denmark on the mainland in Europe, everyone was like crowding around my phone as I was showing them the app and the graphs and everything, what it can do. Everyone was crowding around and be like, wow, that's amazing. Who's this? Who makes this? What's this? So I definitely think that there is a room for this product and this brand to expand and sell to different markets. I think the US market would love this. If you're in the US and you're in the comments right now, let us know, would you like this to come to the US? And hopefully they see this review. This will be a bit difficult to navigate and get your head around if you're a beginner. If you're a, if you're a straight beginner keeper and you've never used any sort of tech like this before, this might be a big hurdle and a little dial on an old analog timer. Analog thermostat might be better for them. Certainly with it being like electronics, there's certainly more to go wrong. It is true that the old analog dial ones, I've never had them go wrong. They've just kept on working like a workhorse for decades. And even they're probably like ancient by the time I bought them secondhand as well. So if you're afraid of technology and you're a technophobe, you can just go analog and go for a dial. But if you are interested in toys, technology, gadgets, to really elevate what we can do with our husbandry, this is the thermostat for you. If you want more videos like this, subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.